Namaste, friends. Welcome to my channel, where I share with you the best tips and tricks on how to achieve financial success and freedom. In today's video, I'm going to talk about one of the most influential books that changed my perspective on money and wealth. I Will Teach You To Be Rich by Ramit Sethi. I Will Teach You To Be Rich is a book that teaches you how to manage your money in a smart and simple way, without sacrificing your lifestyle or happiness. It shows you how to automate your finances, negotiate your salary, invest wisely and spend consciously. It also helps you overcome the psychological barriers and myths that hold you back from achieving your financial goals. In this video, I'm going to share with you the four big wins of I Will Teach You To Be Rich and how you can apply them to your own financial journey. These big wins are the areas where you can make the most impact and difference in your money and your life with the least effort and time. These big wins are 1. Automate your finances. This means that you set up a system that automatically transfers your money from your income to your expenses, your savings, and your investments without you having to lift a finger. This way, you can save money effortlessly, pay your bills on time, and grow your wealth over time. Automating your finances also reduces your stress and anxiety and frees up your time and energy for more important things. How to automate your finances. The first step to automate your finances is to set up your accounts. You need to have a checking account, a savings account, a retirement account, and an investment account. You also need to have a credit card, a debit card, and a cash reserve. You can use tools such as Arrived One or Acorns too, to help you set up your accounts and automate your savings and investments. The second step is to create a budget. You need to know how much money you make, how much money you spend, and how much money you save and invest. You need to allocate your money to the categories that matter most to you, such as rent, groceries, entertainment, travel, etc. You can use tools such as Mint, Trantiti, or YNAB4 to help you create and track your budget and your automation. The third step is to schedule your transfers. You need to decide when and how much money goes where and set up automatic transfers from your checking account to your other accounts. For example, you can transfer 10% of your income to your savings account, 15% to your retirement account, and 20% to your investment account every month. You can also set up automatic payments for your bills, such as your rent, your utilities, your credit card, etc. This way, you can ensure that your money goes where it needs to go, without you having to worry about it. 2. Negotiate your salary. This means that you ask for more money from your employer and get paid what you deserve. Negotiating your salary is one of the most effective ways to earn more money and to increase your income and wealth over time. Negotiating your salary also boosts your confidence and self-esteem and improves your career prospects and opportunities. How to invest smartly. The first step to invest smartly is to choose your investments you need to have a clear and realistic goal for your money and a time horizon for when you need it. You also need to have a risk tolerance and a level of comfort with the volatility and uncertainty of the market. Based on these factors, you need to choose the best investments for your portfolio and diversify them across different asset classes, such as stocks, bonds, mutual funds, ETFs or real estate. You can use tools such as Vanguard or Betterment to help you choose and manage your investments. The second step is to keep your costs low. You need to avoid paying high fees, commissions or taxes that can eat away your returns and reduce your wealth. You need to look for low-cost, high-quality and tax-efficient investments such as index funds, ETFs or robo-advisors. You also need to take advantage of tax-advantaged accounts such as IRAs, 401ks, or HSAs, that can lower your tax bill and increase your savings. The third step is to stay the course. You need to stick to your investment plan and avoid making emotional or impulsive changes based on the market fluctuations or the media hype. 
you need to ignore the noise and focus on the long term. You also need to rebalance your portfolio periodically and adjust it according to your changing goals, needs and circumstances. 4. Spend consciously. This means that you spend money on things that matter to you, that bring you joy and that align with your goals and values. You don't spend money on things that you don't need, that don't make you happy, or that conflict with your values and purpose. You also don't spend money to impress others, to keep up with the Joneses, or to fill a void in your life. How to spend consciously. The first step to spend consciously is to track your spending. You need to know where your money goes and how much you spend on each category, such as rent, groceries, entertainment, travel, etc. You need to analyze your spending patterns and identify your spending triggers, habits and leaks. You can use tools such as Spendee or Money Lover to help you monitor and control your spending. The second step is to prioritize your spending. You need to decide what is important to you and what brings you the most value and joy. You need to allocate your money to the categories that matter most to you and cut costs on the categories that matter least. You can use tools such as the value wheel or the value sort to help you identify and rank your values. The third step is to enjoy your spending. You need to have a balance between saving and spending and to enjoy your money without feeling guilty or stressed. You need to have a conscious spending plan that allows you to spend extravagantly on the things you love and cut costs on the things you don't. You also need to have a spending rule that tells you how much you can spend on each category and when you can splurge or save. These are the four big wins of I will teach you to be rich and that I want to share with you today. I hope you found them useful and inspiring and that you will apply them to your own financial journey. If you want to learn more about these big wins, I highly recommend you to read the book I will teach you to be rich or to watch some of the other videos that I have made on this topic. You can find the links in the description below. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. I'll see you in the next one.